another little panda. He doesn't have any eyeballs anymore, but he's so cute. Good morning, friends, and welcome back to my channel. Today, it is a very snowy day, but I am at Riverside Antiques here in Bedford, Indiana, one of my very favorite places to go in. So let's go in and see what we can find today. There are some newer booths out here. And again, I just can't stress enough. If you use some lamps and lighting in your in your booths, how lovely it makes everything just pop and stand stand out really well. This is a really inter oh, it's sold. That's a really pretty piece. I really like that. All right, so I am looking for seasonal things today. Easter, Valentine's, well, not as much Valentine's Day, more, more Easter than anything else because Valentine's Day is this week. Rounding the corner here, I always come to this booth first. This is my favorite booth here. And I see some things, oh my gosh. Look at the little bunny, Pixie Girl. Okay, she's $10, so we're definitely gonna get her. And then I'm seeing this Viking Balloonique fairy lamp for $28.50. So I will be getting that. I'll check it over a little, make sure that there's no chippies. I'm not seeing it, so that's going to go in the cart too. Right next to it is this lovely piece. It's $14. I do think this is so interesting. Look at this um, octopus on it. So for $14, I'm going to get that. Now this is Viking. These are Viking nesting ashtrays. Um, it's $42 for the set of them. I honestly may get those as well because that's not something that you see all the time, but I'm definitely gonna get this. Here's another piece of Viking blue neek for 15. I'm gonna get that too, I can't resist. And we have a little blue bird of happiness. The little votive candle holder, it's 12. It's signed Leo Ward 1992. Probably gonna get that, and here we have a leopard, you know, panther for 20. Has the original price tag underneath. I'm gonna set him here, I might get him too. I'm gonna get that. I'm kind of looking at this thing with fresh eyes <laughs> as you're seeing him too. This is a cool tablecloth for $12. Oh my gosh, I love that. I love that. Almost looks like a peace sign in there. I know it's not, but. All right, we do have an easy bake oven for $18. It's one, um, it's a Kenner, so it's from the 80s. And we've got a lithograph bucket. I love these. I had a little collection of them um, that I made a display. I'm not seeing the this one, the handle is unattached from there. It's $12. I love the graphics on there though. We've got another bluebird for 10. Another bluebird for 10. And this one's a little bit, has a little bit different of a shape than that one. Oh my, look at you, fancy pants poodle. I think you're a dream pet. You're 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 a lot of fun. I'm gonna get you. Oh my Lanta. Look at these little babies and their flowers. There's that one. And there's that one. Those are stinking adorable. They're $10 for the set. I'm going to get those. This is a Vaseline glass. The little bears on it for nine. Probably glows. This is a flower frog of a pelican. Okay. Do you guys remember these Flatsy dolls? I kind of do, but I kind of don't. I remember the ones that used to pop their clothes on and off, but I don't know that I remember those. But I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna stick those in the cart. I don't know about, I'll check on that. These for sure. All right, down here I see this bunny. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I love the color. He's this beautiful teal with the pink accents. I don't see a tush tag on him anywhere. He's $15, but I may get him for myself, for my own collection. And then she's got some animal stand-ups. 
for your baby. Oh, crochet books for your baby. Whopper paint book. Oh my goodness. It's five dollars. <gasps> Ruthie Newton. Oh my gosh. I love my Ruthie Newton. It looks like a lot of the pages have been colored in. Very nicely, I might add. But the illustrations are all Ruthie Newton. Okay. It's in really good condition, though, honestly. I'm going to think about that. All right, here is a baggie full of these little, I think they're like Ross Bro little baby rattles, and I think they're all baby rattles. This one's a duck, a little chick, and a little Easter bunny. These are 15. Um, let's see what else is down here. St. Patrick's Day. We've got the whole Howard Red Rooster set for 15. I love this Las Vegas sign. It does light up. I've seen it lit up. It's pretty cool. What is this? Her prettiness? Avon, her prettiness. It's got a little bird. Her prettiness, cologne mist. It has this little egg on this little stand for $4. It's like a little novelty thing. St. Patrick's Day. I like those cups down there, but I usually don't do her really pretty well with cups. It's a little anthropomorphic lettuce shakers for 10. A sun rubber little doll, squeaker doll. I'm getting ready to have a um vintage toy sale so I guess seeing if I need to buy some more toys after I have that sale I suppose well, here's another little baby toy here for three dollars I love these little plastic baby toys oh this is cute it's a turtle the little strawberries painted on it little studio piece Alright, so got a few things in our cart already. A lot of red glass here. Oh my goodness, look at this. That baby is not happy with those puppy dogs. That puppy dog took its passy. <laughs> That's adorable. It's adorable. A little print there. Alright, let's see. We got some Pyrex. Except that daisy pattern. I'm horrible at knowing my Pyrex patterns. I really am. Some pink depression glass. Uranium. Pink depression does not do well for me. So I usually don't buy it a lot. Look at this bowl. I don't think that it's vintage, but it's Peacock. Dishwater and microwave safe. That's a fun, colorful Peacock bowl. And then here we've got some Fenton. Oh, it's too bad. Here's the bottom of a Fenton fairy lamp, the Burmese pattern. We don't have the top. This is a lovely color. Oh, beautiful. It's got the foil sticker. It is marked Fenton on the bottom. This one is $37.50. The pink opalesa. Here's a little rose bowl here. Fenton. This is prior to 1971. Water Lily Rose Bowl for 1950. These vintage decals are adorable. Look, it's George Washington and Betsy Ross. And then this gal, she's tattling on somebody, it looks like. I don't know. These are cute though. The outhouse. Adorable. Oh, here's the Ride a Cock Horse nur Nursery Rhymes. I have a little bowl that matches this. Uh, it is $9.50. <laughs> he is taking a... He's taking a tumble. Well, actually, they're both taking a tumble off of that, that horse there. 
looking down here at these little planters. They're really cute. Some of the paint though is missing on several of them. The little boys is two dollars. But then I was looking at this one. That cat is up to no good. And that donkey is looking very worried. I just thought it was so funny. I'm not gonna get it, but I thought it was fun to show. And then this. This is who burned a, the hole in the tablecloth ashtray. It has a little chipperoonie right there, but I don't understand. Got some cake molds. Oh, that's cute. Little homemade valentines, a dollar each. Are they bookmarks? That's really cute. I think I might get a couple of them and use as package toppers. Happy Valentine's, you make my heart smile. Very cute. All of these fairy lamps in one spot. This has got a pagoda one though. It's flash painted though. That was the only thing. And the amber ones I'm not doing right now. This one's a nice one. I already have one like that. I've got some like that. So I'm not going to get those today. I, I like this little spaghetti poodle though. It's $16.99. It is leptin. It's a pink leptin spaghetti poodle. It's missing one of its rhinestones right there. But still a really cute little piece. I don't think I'm going to get it today. I'm probably going to regret it, though. I'm probably going to think about it and want to come back and get him. But I think for right now, I'm not. But he's very cute. There's another bluebird for $8. This one is not signed. And if they're not signed, they would have had a sticker on the bottom of it. I typically just buy the ones that are signed. And when I say I, that I typically buy the ones that are signed is because... I see them a lot and I try to like just rein it in to just buy specific ones so I don't have a, ton, a whole shelf full of them so that's why I say that. doesn't mean that one's any better than the other it's just so I don't have a whole shelf full of them. Goodness hey we've got a little doggy in here that's so cute how much are you little doggy you're seven fifty. You're a cute little doggy, though. I don't know for seven fifty. I don't think I can do. Here's your little pig friend. He's jointed. What is this? Ralph Eugene Tripp Tips baby clothes. Nineteen thirty one. For fifteen dollars, it's a little someone's baby outfit. Oh my gosh, I love stuff like that. I don't know what people would want somebody else's baby clothes. You are seven dollars. I like you. I like that you're jointed. I like that you're sewn together. I'm gonna get you. I like you, teddy bear. We're gonna find you a home. You're gonna be adopted. All right, so I think I'm gonna head on over to another place that's right behind me, and so. We're gonna go over there. We're gonna go ahead and film in there a little bit as well and see if we can find some more things in there. I'll do a little introduction when I get over there so I can let you know where the place is at, but it's just in front of the place that I just was here in Bedford. So let's drive on over there and then we will start part two. So now I am at White River Arts and Antiques, also here in Bedford, just in front of the building, the straw that I was just. Look at old poor Snow White. No, you're a little Dutch girl. She's buried in the snow. So let's go in and see what we can find in here today. You walk in, there's a baby. Hi, baby. Here's a nice, fun little Valentine's Day setup. And look at this. Look at this old shaving kit. So we've got the holder for the brush and the razor. And then. We've got the shaving mug and this beautiful box. It's $135, but wow. There's the top of it. Very, very cool. Let's see. What else is over in here? We go back into this little this little alcove. There's a little cupid. 
I like those. Oh, I see a little um, carnival prize. $67. Oh, I love that. Hot baby. Another baby. Ooh, and a, what are you? A hyena? Oh my. You are. This is a room full of fancy things. Although this is lovely. This picture frame. Wow. It's 24. It still has the stand, which a lot of times you don't see. That's lovely. An Art Nouveau style. I love this. These little... People will buy cutter quilts and they'll do things like this. They'll make little things like the little Valentine hearts are cute. Oh, look at these little kitty cats. That's cute. $8 for the little cat planter. I'll get that for $8. Well, look at this book. Fire Trucks to Color. It's $9. It is Whitman. Of course it is. 1950. And some of the pages have been colored on, but I love that it's a figural book. Uh, I don't know if I can do it for $9, but I think it's lovely. There's some more books here. Billy Bunter. The Bunter Express. It's got some a repair. This one's kind of neat. This basketball book. It's $3.99. Um, 1961. I wonder if it was a textbook. Keeping physically fit. Huh. It's got some kind of cool illustrations in it. Oh, wow. He's the, from the Lakers. Hmm. Kind of like the cover on it. Basketball. Lincoln the Hoosier. I love this ephemera. Birthday and Dream Book. Is it for like makeup and stuff? Oh, I love stuff like this. How much is it? It's two dollars. I'm gonna get that. Let's take out this basket where I can see the stuff a little bit better. Lincoln the Hoosier. Valentine's. School day memories bring back pleasant thoughts of happy hours we spent in work and play. I'll take that out of the bag and look at it. Ooh, clown. No. All right, so let me take this out of the bag and see what this is. All right, it's $4. I'm definitely going to get it. It is. It has a bunch of these um, cards in it and signatures, but it has these greetings and stuff like 19, class of 1927 and different poems, Dear Mabel. When far away in other lands, with other thoughts encircling thy brow, please cast a lingering thought about one who holds you as a friend from Anna. So it's just filled. So I love that. I'm going to get that. All right. I don't know anything about this poodle. It does have some age to it. I can just tell. It's on a wooden base. It's $5.99. It's a pink poodle with like this textured look. It's ceramic. I think I'm going to get it too. I don't know what's going on with this girl, but she's only hanging on to this planter. This cornucopia she is. It's $28.50. It's a little more than what I can do for her. Pink rooster. Oh look, there's a sad clown. Mm. Maybe you shouldn't be a clown. And you wouldn't be sad. Oh, she's salt. She got her hands in her pockets too. She is Napco. She's an old mamma for three dollars. I wish she had pepper with her. I think she's cute. There's a little lithophane fairy light. This one has these little um 
flowers. These look really nice with a candle flickering in them. They do kind of really bounce off of the walls. It's $16. I tend to just, I like the colorful fairy lamps. So I'm not going to get that. All right, I found me a new coffee mug to keep at the shop. I do not care. Meow. I found another baby that needs to be adopted. Another little panda. He doesn't have any eyeballs anymore, but he's so cute. He's $5, so we're going to get you, panda. Well, we hit up two places in one day. And I got some decent things. So everything that you had seen me pick up are things that I did purchase. So if you saw something that you might be interested in, you know, you can always email me and I'll let you know if it's still available or if I'm going to sell it in a live sale. Uh, you can reach me at thrifterjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com. Fun, fun stuff today. You know, I kind of went in just not really looking for, I mean, I'm always looking for holiday things and like Easter things since that's the upcoming holiday. But sometimes I think it's best to go in with an open mind and just see what kind of things pop out at you. So that's what I did today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure that you do, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you, before you go, that you do leave a comment just saying hi, just passing through. Maybe let me know if, if you saw some of the things that maybe I didn't pick up. So when you leave a comment, it does really help the content creator. So even if you're not subscribed, which you really should be because then you get alerts when things go live and all that kind of stuff. But even if you're not subscribed, just leaving a comment really does help a content creator's channel get seen. So if you could do that, I'd appreciate that. And as always, I got to end the videos the same way or it just feels weird to me. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some drama, yes indeed. You say that I should be. Follies, hot tamales to say that I got a pair of eyes just like old Sven Valleys. I confess that I possess them.